And welcome once again to Jacob's Toys. Now, please do like, share, subscribe, and all of those things all support to the channel is very much appreciated. In this video, I have to say once again a massive thank you to Fan Home because they've sent me the next four parts of my Optimus Prime Builder figure. Now, if you don't know who Fan Home are, do check out the description of this video, and there's a link to their website, all the details of how you can pick up your own version of this, as well as some very other cool subscription services. And I'll even put the link to the first video I did of parts one and two so that you can see exactly what this subscription service is all about. But this is the next four parts and I cannot wait to get into it. And here we are taking a look at part six of the Optimus Prime Builder figure. Let's not waste any time and let's get straight into that build. Another small build this time round. This is issue six. We are building another part of the foot. So let's have a look. A little bit about the movie again there at the beginning. And it is really cool because even just in these six issues, I feel like I've read a lot about Transformers. There's a little bit more about it there. There's also another feature, Skywarp this time. So you find out loads about each of the characters. Oh, we're talking comic books this week. So this is about the Marvel comic books, Transformers. So that's definitely going to be an interesting read. Can't wait to get to that and spend a bit of time brushing up on my Transformer history. And we've got another small right leg foot part so it's the wheel and the wheel arch and as you can see it doesn't actually fit onto anything at the moment so we're just gonna have to kind of build this and put this part aside as well it does however follow on from the last issue so I will grab those previous parts so here's the foot piece and here are the wheel bits from the last issue again it comes in a bag instead of a box so just be aware when you're pouring it out not to lose anything all the screws are individually bagged anyway Again, it doesn't look like that much to build, but we are using parts from last issue. So let's get those screws out a little bit fiddly. I do find these bags fiddly. One thing I'm not sure if I've mentioned on previous videos is they do send, to, they do tend to send more screws than you need. So you do have spares in case you drop one or lose one or anything like that. Um, just putting these in here will create the uh, base of the wheel, and then you just got to press the tire on. I uh, previously said how tight the tire, uh, how tough the tire is, so just be careful not to break anything. And let's get this little uh, cover off here. It does fit on these two, as the instruction says it does. Oh, it just takes a little bit of manoeuvring, and there we go, I've got it. So there's four screws into the wheel, and then two screws into the arch, and then that's pretty much it for this issue, which is yeah, less to build in these last two issues but vital all the same I suppose. Let's just have a look, I haven't got anywhere to actually attach this yet but when finished this is what it will look like and it's really starting to come together but if this is the size of the foot how big is the actual model going to be? Once again a massive thank you to Fan Home. I'm really enjoying this build, I cannot wait to see him start to really come together. They're kind of giving us pieces here and there, we've got a foot now, we've got a head, we've got a bit of a chest piece. I can't wait to see how this subscription service grows and see Optimus Prime starting to come to life. Check out the description of this video to see Fan Home's website and of course all the subscription services available there. And of course like, share and subscribe and all of those things to follow along with the rest of the build as well as a whole bunch of other toy and geek content. Thanks very much for watching, I'll see you soon.